It was 30 years ago when Oriole Park and Camden Yards opened its gates for the first time. So 11 TV Hill went inside the ballpark that forever changed baseball ahead of opening day. 11 TV Hill contributor Tommy Clark gives us a sneak peek of the exciting new features. There is so much to look forward to this baseball season. That includes new ballpark bites like these crab cake egg rolls from Jimmy's Famous Seafood. The Baltimore City staple is making its debut in the left field. It'll offer everything from crabby dogs and fries to shrimp platters. We're just excited to you know, bring this to Camden Yards and give baseball fans a treat of Jimmy's. Jimmy's is even naming one new plate after a super fan. He's a household name in Charm City, Mo Gabba. Known for his love of the team and a magnetic personality. He died two years ago after losing his fourth battle with cancer. Mo Gabba shrimp platter will honor his legacy. Our Mo Gabba shrimp platter. So Mo Gabba, if you guys all know, amazing Oriole fan, uh, member of the Orioles Hall of Fame. Uh, we're going to be doing this at the Camden Yards this year, and a dollar from each one for the proceeds will be sent back to the Johns Hopkins Children's Center. The ballpark is also bringing back fan favorites like patty melts, along with some new tastes of their own. We are introducing our crab stuffed pretzel and our pepperoni pretzel. There's also new merchandise to look forward to. Joining me now is Dustin to explain more. Dustin, what all do we have here? We have a, a lot of exclusive items here at Oriole Park this year. Um, outside of the 30th anniversary, we have things um, that are a little bit more exclusive and a little bit different than just your typical uh, name and number T in your jersey. Um, we'll start here quickly. Uh, we have a new brand called Refried. It's all recycled goods. Um, we have a vendor that will take some of our older merchandise and turn it back into something more sustainable and return it to us so we're not wasting the materials. A uh, new jewelry brand as well, Rustic Cuff. Um, price point down to the premium value point as well too, so just so that we uh, can meet everyone's needs when it comes to the jewelry that they're looking for. Um, next, another new brand called Full Turn. It's all recycled materials, recycled water bottles. So it's um, really cool to see how they can take something like that and turn it into uh, a polo. Uh, Vineyard Vines is always a hit, especially in this area. Um, so we work closely with Vineyard Vines to produce some um, unique and new, new uh, graphics for Oriole Park here this year. Um, pets are always something that we want to deck out as well in Baltimore Oriole stuff. So we took advantage of building our line um, in our pet category as well, so that when fans come here for Bark in the Park, they're able to pick something up here on the spot. Um, lastly, we have our new program here, which is the Mystery Box program. It was a hit last year, and we're going to bring it back this year. Um, each Mystery Box for men's, ladies, down to youth will provide a T-shirt, a hat, and a novelty item. And one out of every 25 Mystery Boxes will also include a custom jersey voucher. So kind of a gamble there, but um, really good value inside of this box. Outside the store, final preps are underway. Crews can be seen spraying down seats and working in the dugout. Well, the grub is so good, we ate it all. It's good stuff, people. So that is just the beginning. Of course, there is a lot more to look forward to. Opening day is Monday, April 11th, and we will be there. For TV Hill, I'm Tommy Clark at Camden Yards, WBAL TV 11 News. Thank you. First pitch for the O's home opener against the Milwaukee Brewers. It's set for 305 tomorrow. And if you haven't yet, there's still time to grab a ticket. You can purchase them on the Orioles website at Orioles.com slash tickets. And it wouldn't be a true baseball season without all the free and fun giveaways on Friday, April 15th. That kicks off a three game series with the Yankees. The uh, first 10,000 fans age 15 and over will receive a Jackie Robinson 75th anniversary pen. Then Sunday, April 17th is a much anticipated O's kids opening day. Like in years past, you can expect lots of fun activities for all the young fans. And again, this season, children ages nine and under will have the opportunity to attend games for free. All part of the club's popular kids cheer free program that's presented by Baltimore area Chick-fil-A restaurants. And for a full list of Orioles season events, visit our website. It's WBALTV.com.